I'm back with more free stuff and I'm starting it off with an absolute game changer. If you've ever tried to do facial animation with metahumans or just at all, you know it's an extremely challenging and brutal task and it involves a lot of fine tuning of controls that are really hard to grab, really hard to deal with. And that's especially true on the metahuman face picker. It's just really difficult to work with. It's hard to grab the right control or know which control you're supposed to grab. And thankfully, Locodrome has come to the rescue with a free metahuman face control rig picker that is top notch. It has WASD controls. It's super easy to use. It's very user-friendly, and I'm a huge fan of it. So if you're trying to do animation in Unreal, especially face animation, I have not found anything that comes close to this for being user-friendly, easy to use, and getting the quality of output that I'm looking for when I'm cleaning my facial mocap or doing hand-keyed face poses. You know, head over, links in the description to his YouTube video announcing this. Give it a watch, a like, and a subscribe. And uh, in the description of that video, you'll find the link over to his Gumroad page where you can pull this down for free. Now, while I'm on Gumroad, I want to cover, it's a kind of a sneaky place where you can go get a lot of free stuff in a lot of different areas. So if I just specifically target Unreal Engine, so yep, so there it is. You can go to the category. There's a bunch of categories that you can just look through. And then if you come down to price, Obviously, there's a lot of Unreal Engine stuff, but if you just say max price of zero, you'll see there's quite a lot of stuff, a lot of really interesting stuff and stuff that seems extremely valuable. So let's start with, you can pull down anamorphic lenses that you can then use in your own cinematics. This is a tutorial on how to create a template. So if you have a project template that you're doing a lot of times, especially if you're doing game jams or you have a very, you know, you just have a lot of prototyping that you start off the same way. This is a great way to build out a template so that you can just one click your way to having a setup that you like. There's free 3D models and assets. Like here's some foliage. This is uh, pine trees, absolutely for free. And any of these cases, if they're useful to you, you should go back and give them a donation. Um, there's obviously a lot of stuff with procedural content generation. And some of these things, even if you don't need exactly what they do, like for example, in this case, they do, they take mesh, uh, you know, mesh selection and do dynamic bounds for your PCG. They'll, they'll go in and they improve the spline fill out for PCG. So you can go look at their code as a reference if you want to go build out something similar or figure out how to work with PCG. There's often a lot of really good stuff there. Um, there's resource packs with 3D models, character animations, all that kind of stuff from Game Dev Academy's uh, Unreal Engine 5 for Beginners course. That's completely free. There's full source to Infima Games' FPS game tutorial. And there's this, so a free blueprint to give you planets, which is uh, pretty awesome. If you go take a look at this guy. You know, quite a, like for free, you get this amazing thing that allows you to, uh, you know, go do whatever you want on the moon or Mars. And there's a lot more stuff. I just uh, kind of skimmed the wave tops to show you some of the things that are available, but there's quite a lot of stuff. Now, a lot of the stuff in here is really for Unreal 4. Um, so a lot of it might be outdated, but a lot of that will fold, fold into UE5, but it tells it pretty much up front. You can kind of get a sense of what it's for. Thanks for watching and see you next time.